What is happening, y'all? Welcome on back. So, uh, we're gonna talk to this dude first, and then we're gonna go on up to the place. It's a blacksmith? Well, look at you. We don't receive many visitors. It's like the guts great I sword, I want it. you are uh, tarnished. What brings you here? Oh, pardon me. An old codger. Uh, what are you? Oh, shit. I can purchase somber smithing stones. Uh, do you sell all the tier fives? You don't, but that's still dope. Uh, I could get this higher with 1600. Yes. Oh, when I'm absorbed in my smithing, I lose sight of all else. If you come too close, I'm apt to cause you harm. I am, after all, terribly large compared to you, Tarnished. You don't know how hard it is not to break anything while I work. This territory once belonged to the Carian royal family. After leveling it, by conjuring an enchanted snare, that unless you wish to lie with the corpses of the heedless knight. Oh, whoa. He wasn't kidding about there being traps. Ah! That manor is where I gotta go if I want to get the invasion item, I think. So that looked almost like the, uh, almost like the spot I needed. No, I can't see it now with the fog, son of a bitch. Ow, go away. There's the, there's the towers, there's the tree. We're getting really close to the towers, castle, the tree. It's close, it's really close. Looks like gravestones. Or for all stomp, that sounds badass. That's at Bellum Church. It's gotta be the thing I'm looking for is like up there. Some man, I'm getting hungry. After this episode, we're gonna order some food. But let's get back on track. I wanna I wanna explore the manor.
quiet. Too quiet. Oh, you sh little shit. Well, they're not rare. to be extra cautious. Of the handsies. Oh, great. I'm dead. Oh, you missed. You suck. Tell you what, there is no shortage of somber smithing stones around here. I'll be able to level up any of the special weapons I want. Oh my god, I hate these things so much. Yeah, these hands can straight up just die. I do not care. These are the most obnoxious enemy I think I have ever experienced in a Souls game. Do not like them. They are dicks. Best way to handle these things. Oh, dead again. Well, now that I they, they have taken uh, runes from me twice now. I'm just going to run through. I'm not even, I'm not, I'm not putting up with the handsies. Those things blow. Oh, great. I can't, I can't ride my horse through. Those are like traps. Like you run over them and it like detonates an explosion. Gets me more FP. I don't need you.
All right, how do I go inside of the manor? I'm not having a good time with the manor. This is where I probably need to get to. Demi humans, come buy me time while I run past all the Hansies. There, that's a door. That's a door. Or oh, there's a door over there, too. No, no, no! Go away! Alright, this leads me deeper. out of it, break out of it, before he grabs me. Ow, dude! These things suck balls. Like, holy shit. Even with the, the fire damage staggering them, like, do not like at all. I think that other door is locked. It's probably a shortcut I get for later, but I'm gonna hit that door. And then I'm, I'm beelining it straight up. I have my shield out, ready to go. As I suspected. I don't know how much of this I want to explore the demi humans are doing a good job at just buying me time We never get anything out of those guys. It's just like some vague dialogue that's not voice acted. Oh, thank God. Don't need to deal with the handsies anymore. These things are crazy. Like, I mean, we had hand enemies in, uh, in Dark Souls 3, and they were weak to bleed. They're pretty deadly. But those things, those things are terrifying, dude. They're so fast. That's, I think, the biggest thing I've noticed with uh, the enemies in this game compared to other Souls games is, like, the, the speed and the rate of attack on a lot of enemies is kind of outrageous. Like, uh, 
those weird breakdance things that we were fighting when we were at uh, the the academy. Those things were nutty. The handsies are, are crazy, crazy fast. This way first. The other way looks like progression. Yeah, now that I got a great shield, we're seeing a really, really big difference in uh, how effective things are. We get up to that to 68, that's going to be a huge difference. There is definitely... I really hope it's, it's smoother on console. I mean, From has always been more of a, a console-centric company, so I have a feeling that uh, things are going to be probably really smooth on PlayStation. But I will say, you know, being somebody that is primarily a PC player... Lack of optimization in certain areas. Yeah, it sucks. The thing is, like, I know it's not my rig because this game isn't even like it's not even putting. Um, you know, the 3080 is it's, it's not even. Uh, what is happening? It's work, damn. City. I just pulled up Task Manager, and we're sitting at like 60% GPU utilization, which is nothing. You know, less than half of my, or, or just barely over half of my GPU is being used for this game. So, like, I don't know. It bothers me, you know, because I'm like, you know, clearly there's gas in the tank. You can, you know, there, there's more juice. Use the juice. And it's not using the juice. And like, you know, I don't even care about like graphics, but like those frame dips, man. Those frame dips, shit like that. I, mm. No bueno. level. Oh, not even remotely close to getting a level. Okay, yes, it's functional. Seed? Seed.
go. Come on. You. Pretty good. 300 for killing those wolves. I still think uh, 200, 200 a pop for those dudes at the, uh, when I was trying to reach the Divine Tower. That's still, I think, the best value I've seen. Knight sword, that sounds juicy. Colossal sword, standard great sword, embedded with blue glintstone, weapon of the trolls in service of the royal family of Caria. Called into service when the queen invoked an oath they swore. Look into the distance, let out intense roar, generating a shockwave that blows back surrounding foes, follow up with a strong attack. 18 int, 20 strength, 14 dex. See, I need a sword that's like that, but like the Faith version. But anything that... Send. Why would I come down here? Huh, well, it's a shortcut. I guess I could just come over here, skip past that shit.
Yeah, they aren't too, uh, aren't too deadly. Now that I got a great shield. Fight our way up to what would be like the boss of this area, and then we'll probably wrap this episode, because who knows how many attempts it's going to take. jump from there to there and then oh man I don't know if I'd like that let me see if I can find a grace before I go jumping off cliff tops this this is the boss fight shit all right let's do this this uh, hippity hop thing and then we'll wrap and then we'll do the boss fight I started this playthrough out of all the different weapons that I thought might work well for a uh, shield focus build. A dragon head for a fist is not one that I had considered. But it does work surprisingly well. I cracked pot. Uh, is there more here? If I, like, jump down? Looks like there is. I kind of feel bad murdering all these things. All the promo material for the game, they were like, Pot Friend! I was like, oh, Pot Friends, yay! And then in the actual game, what do you do with the pots? You murder them. You kill the adults, and then you kill the babies, and it's just... Pot genocide. Especially because, like, we, we found the one pot dude who's all like, Oh, a little bit of help, I'm stuck. I'm like, oh, sure, bro. But then beyond him, we just murder these things. Oh, 
that's whatever that shiny is, that's probably what I'm working my way towards with this route. Came all this way for Ash of War, carrying grandeur. Sounds pretty good. All right, um, manor lower level. That's the manor entrance. Manor upper level. Yeah, so we're gonna wrap up. Um, I think we have a boss fight coming up, so y'all stay tuned, and I'll catch y'all with that in a little bit.